Hello, my name is Dax Patton. I'm with Digital Touch Systems, and I'm here to showcase our Snowflake software suite. Um, Snowflake is a multi-touch presentation software solution. It has a number of different applications, and it is fully customizable to create a unique user experience for your specific audience. Um, today I'll show you uh, a little bit about um, how to operate Snowflake. Um, and I'm going to be utilizing um, edited content uh, for a client of ours, Proof Biosciences, who's uh, using uh, the Snowflake software to create a custom uh, interactive experience uh, for a trade show. So as you can see here, I'm, I'm working off of a T6 60-inch uh, touchscreen computer. Uh, this is a multi-touch uh, touchscreen. Um, and in order to start the software, uh, so you'll plug in the unit, um, power it up, uh, there's a power button on the side, uh, you'll turn on the monitor with the input buttons on the right side over here. Um, on the desktop, you're going to have a snowflake suite icon, and in order to start the software, you'll just want to double tap on that icon. This is going to uh, this is going to turn on the Snowflake software suite, and it'll be taking us to the customized Prove Biosciences home screen. As you can see on these home screens, we have a number of things happening. Um, up top, we have a what we call as our RSS feed um, with uh, a customized message uh, that Prove uh, wanted to show. Um, below here. Uh, we have uh, a live Twitter feed. Um, both of these uh, lines are customizable, so if I want to send this text back the other direction, I have that option. On the home screen, you'll see a number of icons. Uh, these are custom uh, applications. Um, we have everything from a PDF viewer um, that you can look through interactive um, you know, PDFs, um, a media viewer, that allows you to put different images, videos, uh, JPEGs, uh, PNGs, PDF files uh, into a, a single uh, interface. Uh, we have a slider that's great for, say, maybe a PowerPoint type presentation uh, where you can go through different images and, and videos. Um, guestbook for uh, logging leads and, and uh, for users to enter their information uh, so you can follow up with them at a later date. Uh, we have a Hotel Maps or is, is how they branded it. It's also a, kind of like a wayfinding type solution uh, where there's a predetermined map. Um, browser to pull up a website, uh, YouTube, Twitter, uh, a video drawing application, uh, whiteboard to turn it into an interactive whiteboard surface, and a, a maps to, uh, that's integrated with Google Maps. The first what I'm going to do is uh, showcase um, our, our first application, which would be the PDF viewer. Um, as you can see, I'm, I'm clicking, touching on the uh, PDF icon. Um, and as you see here, we have a list of different PDFs that we can uh, choose between. Um, this one being the drug metabolism uh, PDF. And everything's interactive. So I can actually flip through multiple pages um, either through this search bar right here, um, so I can go to page one, page two, or through a simple hand swipe um, from left to right, depending on what page I'm on. It, it doesn't stop there. Um, through pinching and zoom motion, through, through, through the use of two fingers, um, and expanding them apart or bringing them closer together, I'm able to zoom in and zoom out on a document. There's some additional functionality that the PDF Viewer and Snowflake provides, and it's actually a built-in annotation tool. So let's say I'm presenting to um, my audience and I wanted to focus in on this diagram right here. When I actually can operate the corner menu uh, that's located in the bottom left corner here, it'll pop up a menu with different options on it. I'm going to go ahead and pick this pen-looking icon and you'll notice that it pulls up a toolbar with different uh, color schemes of uh, uh, markers. Um, I can choose an eraser. Um, I can go back to my pen tool and actually annotate on different, you know, on the screen itself. 
sort of focus in on some type of concept or presentation that I'd like to uh, provide to my client. Um, I can go ahead and X out of the annotation software and I can go ahead and either zoom out of my uh, PDF presentation, move to another PDF, or go back to the home screen. Now, in, with operating the Snowflake software, uh, basically your main point of contact to get through the software is going to be in this corner menu in the bottom left. It's always going to be constant. Um, you can see an X button that will allow me to exit out of the, that different application back to the home screen. I'm going to go ahead and go through a few other applications and um, we'll continue on. Um, the media application um, is an uh, interface to where we can put different media files, whether they're images or videos or even PDFs, um, into a, a toolbar on the left hand side of the screen. I can pinch and zoom, uh, rotate, uh, whatever functionality I'd like. Uh, you can do this with multiple people using the screen, um, as you can see, uh, very multi-touch uh, functionality. If I want to bring an image back, I can just touch and drag it uh, back to this toolbar. And I can even minimize this toolbar on the left and really focus in um, on a specific image um, through this uh, full screen expansion button. Um, I will hit that again, that will bring it back to its normal size. I can operate as much as I'd like. I'm going to go ahead and exit back out of the software uh, through the corner menu and the X button and uh, move on to another application. This is what we call our slider. It uh, allows me to put a lot of images. This is great if you want to uh, kind of create the same effect as a PowerPoint presentation. Uh, you can slide through the different images and uh, actually use this navigation button at the bottom to you know, jump from uh, you know, slide to slide. Uh, this is an example of a video uh, existing within the slider application. I'm going to go ahead and exit out again. Um, the guest book, um, as you can see, you can enter your name, email. Uh, there's a keyboard that pops up and you can go ahead and submit that information and it'll store it there locally on the computer uh, so your team can access it later. Um, this is a uh, wayfinding type application uh, that allows you to build out a, a map as you see fit. Um, you can do different floors, um, have different um, categories and uh, different filters of what you want to be showcasing um, in your map. As, as you can see here is the Cosmopolitan um, in Las Vegas um, you know, put into, a, uh, you know, into the uh, application. Um, moving on, uh, we have a web browser tool um, that we can link to any home page and um, this being the Crew Biosciences homepage. <laughs> I didn't know about that. 